In the first part of this example, we're defining a standalone view component called standalone button. It's a minimal component with only a template and a click handler method. This component comprises a single button which, when clicked, will log a message to the console. Notice how we export the component with export default, which allows us to import this component into other files. Moving on to the main component, we're importing our standalone button component that we've just defined. This import allows us to use less than standalone button, greater than directly within the main component's template. Notice how the standalone component is part of the component's object even though we didn't have to import or create a dedicated view module for it. It's just a direct reference to the standalone component, which greatly simplifies dependency management and reuse. In the template string of main component, we have a div element that contains an h1 tag and the standalone button component. This demonstrates the simplicity of incorporating the standalone component right within the HTML structure of this parent component. Once the main component is rendered, it will present a welcoming message along with our clickable button just beneath it. Looking back at the standalone button component, the click handler method is what gets called when the button is clicked. This function is simple. It just logs the text button clicked to the browser console. It's a great way to confirm that the button is working and the component integration is successful.